For learning more about a crash that killed a pedestrian in North Smithfield over the weekend, it happened around 10 last night on Dowling Village Boulevard right near Eddie Dowling Highway. Eyewitness News reporter Steve Nielsen spoke to police today and is live in studio now with what they believe happened. Steve? Well, I learned today from North Smithfield Police a nurse was driving by and stopped to give aid before paramedics got there. Ultimately, though, Cheryl Willard died at the hospital. Eyewitness News cameras roll Sunday night as accident reconstruction teams work in North Smithfield. It was here around 930. Police say a woman, Cheryl Willard, was walking along 146, passing by the entrance to Dowling Village. Police say just as she stepped into the road, this car turned in and hit Willard. Authorities say a nurse drove by, saw the scene and rushed to help before the ambulance arrived. Willard died, though, at the hospital. As they investigated, police tell us Willard was wearing dark clothing Sunday night. Her purse was still in the road as well as a shoe. Our cameras capture damage to the front passenger side bumper. Police say the driver, 31-year-old Richard Roach, had a suspended license, suspended registration, expired inspection, and didn't have insurance. Authorities say he stayed at the scene and cooperated. Cheryl Willard was 50 years old. Oroch has been charged with operating on a suspended license, registration, and expired inspection sticker. Also, he was charged with operation without evidence of insurance. North Smithfield Police told me today it is possible there could be more charges, but unlikely. I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.